I joined only Speed for this. Uh, I had consulted my seniors. They advised me that Speed is a good platform to learn. The teachers, from my experience, the classes were amazing, really good. So I've made my own notes. I know they'll they'll be helpful to me throughout. And the classes are really helpful. I could recollect. A lot of times, reading on your own is not sufficient. I want to thank Speed entire team and the good platform where we can study and do well in exams. <laughs> so I bring in all the wishes and greetings uh, to Dr. Komal Ratella for scoring a topmost rank of AML 12 in MCH Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery in INI SS April 2024 session. Congratulations to you, Doctor. Thank you, sir. Doctor, can we know uh, a brief background history of where you started till date, what all you have done? Uh, sir, I have done my MBBS from KMC Mangalore, Manipal University. After that, I've done my uh, DNB general surgery from St. Stephen's Hospital, New Delhi. Uh, after that, I did a brief uh, SR ship at various Delhi uh, hospitals, including Ames Delhi Plastic Surgery, where I re- finally realized this, yes, this is the branch for me. And then uh, this April, I've given exam for INISS and luckily uh, I got okay. a decent rank. Doctor, can you tell us uh, why plastic surgery? Uh, so, uh, when I worked in the department, uh, I realized that as a general surgeon, I had very less exposure of the subject. I didn't know what exactly is being done and how important work is being done. It's not just cosmetics. There's a large part of reconstruction and trauma reconstruction, which we didn't, I, which I didn't know before that. And that was really interesting to me. And also there's so much uh, incorporation of recent advances, microsurgery, super microsurgery, which is quite interesting, which interested me a lot. So that's why I chose this branch. Okay. Very nice, doctor. Now, uh, can you tell us, uh, once you decided to do a plastic surgery, what all you did and what uh, what are the preparation strategy to reach this rank? Uh, So I joined only Speed for this. Uh, I had consulted my seniors who were already working in Ames Delhi. And uh, they advised me that Speed is a good platform to learn. Uh, The teachers, from my experience, the classes were amazing, really good. So I've made my own notes. I know they'll they'll be helpful to me throughout. And the classes are really helpful. I could recollect. A lot of times, reading on your own is not sufficient. So that was very helpful. And then I got a few MCQs done randomly from some books. And that's it. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> so was it a full-time preparation or how mean mean is that how long no, is full-time how long work and preparing something uh i studied for two months sir. Okay. so i took a break from february and it was a full-time preparation okay. i could not do it along with my work so how many questions did you attend sir i attempted 72 that eight sir. you left was from plastic or gentle it was from plastic okay <laughs> Can you share some of your experiences of the interview? I mean, how it was conducted and what way you were preparing and what was asked, something on that? Uh, so, sir, uh, it was a Zoom meeting. Uh, all the participants, I, I believe they were given different time slots and we had to log in. Uh, my time was at around 2 p.m. Uh, after logging in, uh, there were six uh, consultants who took our interviews at different times. And uh, with each in, with each consultant, uh, they took about 15, 10 to 15 minutes of interview. And it was mostly theoretical and also based on what experience, since I had mentioned that I had experience previously in the department. So it was a lot based on my experiences, what I had seen. And from there, they went on uh, the topics that I mentioned. So there was a lot of questions on flaps on burns, since there's a very big burn center where I worked at. I mentioned microsurgery also. So they asked a few questions based on that cleft flip, rhinoplasty, uh, basically everything that I prepared for during, for my MCQ exam, a bit of everything was asked. Uh, so, yes. Great. Doctor, what will be your advice for the future aspirants of MCH plastic surgery? So if, if for people who are aspiring, uh, I think if you are sure of the subject, if you really love the subject, then give your full dedication and prepare for it. It's not very difficult. If you love the subject, you'll understand it and you'll enjoy studying and preparing for it because plastic surgery is a branch which requires patience. 
and only if you love it go ahead study properly and i and i i felt was a very i felt very happy after giving the exam the questions the patterns they were very basic yet they were important topics there was nothing very out of the ordinary which someone would expect not to know obviously there are maybe 5 10 questions which they have to put because uh it's a competitive exam but otherwise if you know your basics and so <laughs> you'll be good to go good to go correct doctor time to thank and whom all you want to thank you can use this platform to do so we made your career through it thank you so much sir. i want to thank speed entire team and especially you sir thank you so much for giving us a good platform where we can study and do well in exams <laughs> thank you <laughs> thank you doctor anybody who want you want to thank anybody mean uh, who have been with you mean to be with sir, you in career parents family speed <laughs> <laughs> great and all my seniors thank you sir yes so once again we wish you all the very best and all the success for a a great career in mch plastic and reconstructive surgery doctor keep going and you are you are following your passion and passion mm-hmm. follows you now it has become a reality and that <laughs> reality is going to do wonders for you and uh, thank and you sir keep enjoying it and keep the momentum on all the best to you thank you so much thank okay. you